Draped in Union Jack flags and holding celebration cakes and banners, fans of Britain's royal family camped out overnight in the pouring rain for the christening of baby Prince George on Wednesday. The third in line to the throne and son of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge will be christened at the Chapel Royale inside St James's Palace in London in a break with royal tradition, which normally sees high-ranking royals baptised at Buckingham Palace. A handful of supporters braved the winds and heavy downpours that fell most of the night and early Wednesday morning to ensure a good view of arrivals at the historic palace. It was um, it was awful last night with all the rain. Um, we got soaking wet, but we uh, we want to be here for the um, christening of Prince George today. We were at St Mary's for him being born, and I felt that you know I had to come here for, um, for him being baptised. Some believe Prince William and his wife Kate chose the Chapel Royale because that was where his mother, Prince Diana's body, lay after she died in a Paris car crash. Archbishop of Canterbury Justin Welby, spiritual leader of the Church of England, will conduct the private 45-minute service in the Chapel Royale at 2pm. Only close family and friends will attend. The room is where Elizabeth I said prayers before the Spanish Armada was defeated in 1588, where Charles I received communion before his execution in 1649, and where Queen Victoria married Prince Albert in 1840.